we must understand everything that's within that, that was entrenched in, in the context of the Declaration of Independence. We must understand how proofs that James Madison had to counter extort people with um, George Washington to force them to do um, the political theater of the, the Boston Tea Party. Nobody, nobody would have had the uh, nobody would have had the courage to to, to, to fight in the, uh, for that battle. You know. For the American Revolution to stand up against T tax when they had terror laws, terror prisons, terror health care, with laws not just against the um, Native Americans, not just against people with pigmented skin. These were laws against um, every type. It was forcing people to blame uh, a breaching method, forcing, forcing, um, forcing people to claim rights to types, and not to. Um, and to blame that on lies and on delusions instead. In other words, our most sophisticated, our agencies, they were forced already with terror prisons and with terror health care care and terror laws, forcing people to, 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 to uh, monitor database relationships. In other words, international companies, not just international companies, international criminal criminally legalized um, policing agencies, natures, foreign ones, and their juxtapositions with overtly criminal intonation extra, um, inter criminal enterprises. I'm not a lawyer, I'm not a cop, I'm not a criminal. But their juxtaposition with them, it was a method of having everyone blame all the chaos and all the uh, indifference to top-down roles with lies connected to murders into the natures of them and like mass mass murder mass to terror you mean it's all sick slavery is and native american just indifference to our, and saying oh okay well, that's money you know it's more than money it's the legal nature is never addressed free and there's proofs of it because they they force on mass they force um Forced, there was t there was forced political theater. There was lies forced by James Madison. Pretend he had to pretend he didn't know who he was. He was the guy who made the plan for us to someday defend the truth, to prove, you know, to extend the truth, to prove the proofs that exist that prisons are with an international um, and healthcare. Are with an international database evidence fabrication crime nature juxtaposed with the criminals and 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 with the prisoners associated with areas juxtaposed with internation criminal organ uh, criminal enterprises and with everybody not understanding about that because our agencies don't understand it. If our agencies understand that, then they would they they, they would d describe criminal insidiousness, and they would see and understand criminal insidiousness, trained with terror roles to um, force political theater that was forced on James Madison, pretended still. In other words, no one had the courage for the uh, for, for, for the for the Boston Tea Party. They were counter extorted by James Madison and by George Washington. If they weren't, if they hadn't been counter extorted, they would have never, they never had the, the uh, courage to break the other laws that they broke. Never had nothing to do with tea, in other words. And what they did was counter extort people who extort, uh, associated with the prisons. But it was per a method that was long-term. Not as long-term as we've taken. Uh, we lost on significant fronts in the American Revolution in low, forced, categorically uh, delusional and predatory campus natures involved with this today for recorded proofs. So we must understand in sequence American history, and this begins with, with, with understanding active um, lies and delusions defending American history as is and insulating known um, but lied about criminal roles and lies and delusions 
demonstrable with psychology through time and with their database roles in their nation, um, prison and healthcare commodity roles in nature. Two with them, it, 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 these these are critical places. Our our, our, our healthcare. We can't have people with delusions there. Uh, and with evidence fabrication rules. Every day when people when people go to court, the courts are working with these with, with these psychologists involved with delusions, involved with um recorded delusions and recorded lie roles and you know, pretending evidence fabrication sequences and we have a problem we're, we're supposed to be when someone's charged with something, we're supposed to just give them a charge and then and and, and, and then not show them any uh, proofs and then pretend there's no pretend lies when there's no writing allowed and with threats that's why it's important too that to understand how the media is, is uh, was affected to to to, to self-defend positions they took pretending to meet a fake relationship to the doctors growing up I never had a mental diagnosis growing up these people used to tell the rumors about me when I was growing up I never had um, a conversation in my life with someone who was implied to be on the a police report. I haven't seen the police report yet, but I, but, but 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 I know the the media too has roles with um strangers who have been threatening me online. Not just one person, and not just the person who, who, who with the number of confessions, not not recorded, but the semi-recorded, demonstrable tied to the uh, re related courts. Um. So we have a serious problem, you know, and no one responds to writing. The media has an obligation to respond to me in writing. They went all this way to project lies about me that are recorded, known into the into the public. You know, there's proofs that that this is a relationship to um. Criminality related to the policing stewardships of the media and, and their natures and relationships because they have really the, the media demonstrates like when, when you have a, a serial killer, you have to, and, and, and there's um, say there's federal investigations that are coming and they're trying to, uh, you're trying to understand facts that were already addressed in the past, you know what I'm saying? But we're trying to stand, they, they, were, they, were, they were addressed with lies and with delusions apart with them. So what you do is you take out the lies and you take out the delusions. And that requires an active response to facts. And not se sequence shifting facts. Not with related recorded officers switching names. And witnesses switching names. And, sw and with related evidence sequence shifts. For example, with, with the college. That, then, then, then they pretend me into fake conversations. And everyone's blaming what the data, what the database says, and what, 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 while while the police involved criminally are insidiously are pretending illusions and pretending not to know facts, and pretending people to delusions, who people who are only asking facts to be addressed. So then, once they do that, then they have to. So then the person has to go say, okay, look. I asked to have these these, these murder threats and, and, and these body dumping confessions made to me and these untimely death confessions from strangers affected to me by related police involved with, with their drug roles with the campuses through time. You know, in other words, I asked for specific for, uh, threats to be addressed rather than having them addressed. They threatened me not to ask for anything in writing. The, the court and, and and the court is with the person who sent me the one of the people who've been sending the online threats you know and they and then they're the orchestra they're they're they're, they're, they're um, or organizing witnesses with illusions that that, that that aren't even being seen by the people involved getting it with, with um, proofs of related um, interbranch natures of crime with the streams going to prison and with the nature there when they get to the prison. We have an inter, there are proofs of inter gang nature of crime, of evidence fabrications, and of delusion propagation roles with um, psychology, and they're aware of it. I mean, 
so we have to we have to address too. We have to address the, the roles with campuses. Uh, proofs that, for example, with investigation of untimely death at Trinity College, there's another one related to that, related to a person who who, who brought up a place that I was arrested for bringing up, what and involved with his roles with, with threats against my family, and against kids to me. You know what I mean? And then. This is before the media went and put uh, related lies about me and, and with fake um, diagnosis growing up. I had no doctor growing up. I had no mental problem growing up. Um, I had, you know, I had people slandered me from the background. I never had a conversation with. Now they want to pretend that, 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 that they knew me. You know what I mean? Or, or, or the people who, who, who do know me, they want to pretend that they're not aware that they have um, evidence fabrication roles in the past that are demonstrable. You know what I'm saying? And, and what they did was interweave it with all kinds of insidious things to make it disgusting to even talk about. So then the people are going to, um, you know, half talk and the people, are, the, the, um, the courts criminally involved consciously per recorded proofs and psychologists criminally involved recorded per recorded proofs they're using they're using delusions indifferent to to, to um interbranch evidence fabrication roles with the forced um delusions of psychology and the evidence fabrication methods with it enabled by it um its credibility remaining unchecked it will, 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 when it, when it's delusional and, and, and used for um, street for evidence fabrication, the interbranch fabrications, for example, related to proofs that there were 9-11 conversations and uh, forged doctors' um, names on fake diagnoses on fake conversations about 9-11 in relationship to its investigations and with related roles of um, proofs of a number of police forms involved with directing um, psychologists to tell categorical lies and with their with, and with the interbranch roles aware of um, their needs to sequence change facts so the the summary is we just need to deal with facts someone from the court is involved with people who have been threatening me and that was posted to me when i tried to report this to the police they are already involved they were already involved with recorded evidence fabrication roles and switching names and threats against me and my family and attaching my family to fake conversations with the media too did this because it's a, it's a it's like a blitzkrieg of, uh, of, of of lies and of sensibilities attached to too many things at once with people trying with people trying to sequence shift facts and pretend that you know <clears throat> when and where the courts and, and the prison families involved with the streets and, and with that weaponized it, it, it is offensively too much for people to, to face you know what I mean the only thing we can do to help us is to, is to deal with facts and time for tracks